Hey, good afternoon, everyone. We're back in the Pratt Pack Gym, getting ready for Rock Pratt Monday night at 7. We start off after local news with Joe Destillo with Dr. Gerald Pfeiffer, your host in Medical Frontiers, brought to you by the Allegheny Health Network, part of the Highmark Healthcare Company. Tonight's topic, pancreatic cancer. You can phone in with your questions at 866-391-1020 or at Dollar Bank Instant Access at kdk.com. Throughout the night, CBS Radio News, the active of the forecast, and some great guests on the Disk Institute of Pittsburgh Newsline. Brian Coble, he's a vice president and senior research analyst from Heffron Tillotson. Jeff Bezos, recently the richest man in the world for a short time before he was bumped out of that number one position by Bill Gates, who has been number one. He, of course, from Microsoft since 2013. That according to the Bloomberg Index. But who is Jeff Bezos? And is it true that he made his fortune by starting to sell books? We're going to find out about that. Plus, people like Mellon and Rockefeller and Henry Ford, what they would be worth in today's dollars, and regulations today would have not let them make their fortunes. That's a possibility back then. And if that was the case, how the course of history would have been rewritten. And it's trade deadline in Major League Baseball. Greg Dale of Vantage Management Group will drop by in the 10 o'clock hour. President Trump today has a new chief of staff. John Kelly was sworn in. He also has more on North Korea saying we'll handle it, but no specifics, but he continues to be upset with China. Speaking of upset, an unpredictable neighbor, that's what Vice President Michael Pence has called Russia, as the words continue to heat up following all of the news of Russian sanctions. So we got a busy night. We start at 7 on News Radio 1020 KDKA. I hope you will join me. Good afternoon.